Hello and welcome to the how to video series of WP Ultimate CSP Importer. This video will demonstrate the import of simple posts in multiple languages with WPML. Let's get started. Here I have chosen different site languages and used English as a default language. Let's prepare our CSV file. You can add your own text in the post title, content and excerpt fields. The date format should be in the default WordPress format that is year, month and date. To choose a particular category or tag, mention the desired value. To choose multiple categories, you have to use the pipeline separator and to choose the nested category, you have to use the hyphen and then a greater than symbol separator. And for tags, you have to use the comma separator. Mention your own post author and in the featured image, you can either use your WordPress media gallery URL or any publicly accessible external URL. Here I have used an external URL and then I have added the image title and alt text and then the post lag. Post status, you have to mention the post status here for private and password protected. You have to mention the password in within the carry braces. And for post format, zero represents the standard post format. So to import post in multiple languages, you have to add an additional column that is the language code. So the first three posts represents the default language and I have translated the post Range Rover in three different languages in Arabic, French and then Spanish. So here are the values and to relate your translated post with the default post, add one more column that is translated post title. You have to mention your default post title here. So I am going to relate the Arabic post with my default post English. So I have mentioned the post title range over here. So that's all about the CSV preparation. Now let's import the values. First choose your CSV file. If you are going to import new content, you can choose it as new item or if you are going to update an existing content, choose it as existing items. Now I am going to import a new content. And my post type is post. I'm going to import it as post. Click on continue. So here map your desired WP fields with your CSV headers. Choose the appropriate values from this drop down. If your CSV header is same as that of the WP fields, then importer will automatically map the fields. So navigate to the WPML section, map the language code and the translated post title. To save your current mapping as a template, mention the template name here and click on continue. So in this import, I have used external images. If you have used any external images, enable this option. And to import your image title, map the desired fields. Once done, click on continue. Now click on import. That's it. My import is successful. Let's check our post. So these are the values. I have imported four different posts in the English language and one in Arabic and then Spanish as well as in French. So by this way, you can easily import any number of posts in multiple languages with WPA Ultimate CSV Importer. Thank you for watching.